So July 9th, 2019, my name is Eric Kalusik with All Corners Home Inspections. This is the crawl space evaluation for the single family home, South Beach, in Newport, Oregon, or south of Newport, Oregon. As with all the videos in this report, we request that you view this video as supplemental to the written version of the report to which this video has been attached. At the time of inspection, there's just a couple of reportable challenges in this single family home's raised foundation crawl space. We'll do our best to detail those couple of challenges here. First challenge we'll identify is that we have a minor support condition at the, uh, let's see here, it would be underneath the master bathroom uh, waste lines. You can see someone's used a series of two by fours to support this uh, sort of short section of plumbing. And then we also see that the support structure, the galvanized, it's also known as plumber's tape, it's not tape, but it's actually just galvanized um, uh, metal at the left hand side of the screen here, you can see it's pretty badly rusted. We recommend evaluation and repair by a licensed plumbing contractor for those two support challenges. We're about as far back into the left, oh, excuse me, back into the right in the crawl space as you can get. Pretty far, like as far away as the, from the crawl space entrance as you can get. We're going to turn our attention to the sill plate. That's the piece of framing that's the first to interact with the foundation. That's this, in this case, the 2x6. We're on the right-hand side right now. Going to move our way over to the rear portion of the of the crawl space. Uh, the sill plate uh, further over in this direction is being impacted by a fairly tenacious wood-destroying organism called a powder post beetle. There's two varieties, a black and a white powder post beetle. Uh, we see no signs that they're currently present. However, we do see their, uh, their characteristic, or their sort of unique looking ovular holes uh, that they use to burrow into the wood. We recommend putting this home on a pest control schedule and possibly uh, uh, repair by a licensed contractor. However, at the time of inspection, we can't seem to identify any areas where we have structural damage due to the wood-destroying organisms. Uh, they appear to have made a sort of topical movement into the sill plate. That may be due to the fact that this sill plate is pressure-treated. They're not particularly interested in pressure-treated wood. They may be uh, burrowing or just sort of uh, uh, investigative holes by those, uh, by those organisms. Again, but we'd still recommend putting this home on a pest control schedule. Speaking of pests, we see no signs that the structure has any current uh, rodent activity in the crawl space. However, there are some signs, fairly minor signs, of uh, rodent activity in the crawl. Some uh, small carcasses and uh, uh, poo left behind by the rodents. Uh, we would recommend being sort of diligent about making sure that the uh, crawl space vents and uh, areas around the structure are maintained to keep uh, those sort of environments out of the single family homes. Otherwise, good, tight crawl space. This has been Eric Kalusik with all the corners on one section.